Warning. This video is a response video to Zobie 70 and I highly got a highly, I highly recommend you guys check out his video because he said some stuff that if you're an anime fan, it will kick you the hell off. But yeah, Zobie, I'm coming for your cheeks, bruh. I'm coming for your cheeks because you said something that didn't make me happy and yeah, just to watch the video. Yo, what's up guys, my Excalibur, and today I'm talking to you guys about some Dragon Ball Super and I'm joined by Dr. Blake. Yo, what is up? It's Dr. Blake, the Dark is my Yeah, so pretty much we're going to address the uh, recent, I want to say, uh, I guess, things that people have been saying about the uh, ep first episode of Dragon Ball Super. Now, to start off, I, I like the first episode. It, it was really cool for what it was. Like, I wasn't expecting too much action or just, you know, anything like too major. It was good for what it was. But, like, I hear people, for example, like, Zobi70, saying that, like, this one episode was super, like, godlike and amazing. But I don't understand in what way it was. Because it was a cool episode, don't get me wrong, I liked it. But, like, I don't, I don't get how it was so mesmerizing as he was saying it was. And, um, yeah, that's... Just, pretty much how I want to start this off. Um, Blick, you can continue. I'm going to say this. When I upload this on my channel, this is going to be done as a response video. Like, for anyone that wants to, like, if they're looking at this on my channel, this is a response video to Zobi70. And I'm basically going to say this. You can't say an anime is godlike based on one episode. You can't say that because one episode, I've seen better first episodes. I don't get me wrong. I really enjoyed that first episode of Dragon Ball Super. It was all right. It was, it was, it was decent. It was a decent episode, but you can't say it's godlike just because of Dragon Ball. Like, there's some people out there that are being biased. I see people going, that, oh, this episode didn't have too much action. Come on, it's the first episode. Not everything dives straight into action. People knew what was going to happen. People knew what to expect when it's like Dragon Ball Super. You've seen the preview. You've read, you've read the manga. You've seen all this stuff. But if you haven't, like, come on. The first episode of Dragon Ball Z was just pretty much Goku saving Gohan. No, nothing really major happened and i don't understand why people are moaning but then again there are people that over expected the things because it's dragon ball and they got over excited i can understand that i can understand that a lot but i don't like it when people just try and say it's godlike and say well, there's no need to watch other animes because dragon ball's here like it's good dragon ball's my favorite anime it's the thing that got me into watching anime but you still got you still got to be realistic about it. It's just one episode. It has the potential to be good. We just need to stop putting such high expectations, such high hopes up because it's Dragon Ball. Like I see it as any other anime. Okay, it can't be seen as any other anime. It's Dragon Ball because Dragon Ball is the biggest anime that's ever. But I don't like it when people are saying that it's godlike based on one episode. That it's just a, a masterpiece, pure greatness. I I don't agree with what. Like Zobi70 said, well, that's his own opinion. At least he's being honest if he wants to, like, like saying what's on his mind. But in my own opinion, I do not agree with what, him say, what he's saying. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, I think the problem is that, like, people are comparing Dragon Ball Super to Dragon Ball Z so much to the point where they won't let Super have its own identity. Yeah. Because you need to, you need to let it have its own identity. You need to let Super be like Super, and let Dragon Ball Z be Dragon Ball Z. Like if you compare the two, that you're you're letting your you're setting yourself up to get slapped in the cheeks and just let this series not reach its full potential. Because this series has a lot of potential. It, but well, there's still time for it to flop. You know what I'm saying? It right. could flop to the fact that you're overhyping it based on one episode. We haven't even seen the action. We haven't even seen. How they're gonna fight? We haven't even seen what the Super Dragon Balls are gonna do. We haven't even seen what Shampoo's gonna do. We haven't seen a lot. We've seen one episode. We've seen one episode. That's why I'm looking forward to it. Looking forward to watching it weekly. I'm looking forward to watching everything because Dragon Ball is a really good series. I really enjoy it. I just don't like it when people overhype stuff, drag it to the point that it actually just annoys me. I just want people just to be real. Like, come on, it's one episode. We haven't seen nothing major, nothing exciting has happened. We've seen a standard episode, a standard good episode. Nothing major, nothing amazing happened. Like, what is there to make you go, wow, this is this is greatness. This is greatness. Nothing happened. Nothing really happened. 
it was an okay episode. That's all I gotta say, pretty much. I just don't like it when people just stretch how good something really is. It was good, yeah. but it wasn't like spectacular. Like I'm gonna say this, SAO had a better like first episode than this episode. Like I can name other animes that had a better first episode than Dragon Ball Super. But then again, this is trying to like re-familiarize with re-familiarize us with other characters. Like like what like. <laughs> This is trying to like introduce, reintroduce us to these characters and like trying to get us like back into this and trying to get us like comfortable watching this. I understand that, but this wasn't an amazing episode. It was a good episode. It wasn't amazing. It wasn't to the point that I should drop every anime. It wasn't to the point that this one episode destroyed the whole of Naruto. No, because it's one episode, nothing major happened. And yeah, like that's pretty much all I got to say. Right. Yeah. Overall, Dragon Ball is Dragon Ball. Just another anime out there. And if it has a first episode that's not really, you know, too, you know, too. What's the I'm trying to find here? Um, There's no plot twist. There was nothing. There was just the standard episode, just pretty much leading us up to the Battle of God Saga and the Fukatsu no F Saga. It was, there, was, there was no plot twist. There was nothing that actually got you out of your chair, that actually got your cheeks strapped down, proper glued. I Not even stapled, man. <laughs> There's just exactly. nothing really. Like, that actually got you on the edge of the sea, like, oh, what's going to happen next? No, it was just a standard episode, just introducing us to the characters again. Goku having that flashback. It was it was just a standard episode. But I want to know what you guys think. Yeah, like, put it down in the comments below. I want to know what you guys think overall about this. If, tell us if we're wrong. Tell us if we're right. Like, just, just tell us what you're thinking. Because seeing this video just... It wasn't really annoyed me. It just made me want to say my opinions about it. That's the whole reason why I make response videos and Alf was, Alf was the one who like asked me if I wanted to do this video. And yeah, like Alf, you got anything more to add? Um, yeah, that's pretty much all. It's just like Dragon Ball is an anime that is going to have boring episodes and you should ju judge them as that. They aren't going to be too major. Uh, yeah. So uh, do you want to uh, take it out or should I? Um, okay, I'll take it out. So, please comment and subscribe i know i say this all the time but i didn't do i'm just saying please leave a like rating and enjoy this video and yeah catch you next one guys bye